off the international ring at Spruce Meadows as defending champion Lauren Huff of the United States prepares to take on the CN reliability course. You can see at the south end the one uncovered grandstand not quite at capacity today under these weather conditions. The rest of the seats just about full in the international stadium as Lauren Huff and Classical look to relive what was almost an unbelievable dream for them a year ago as they won the first two legs of the CN Precision Series. Million dollars in bonus money available for any horse rider combination that wins all four of the International Grand Prix at Spruce Meadows this year. Lauren Huff aboard Classico gets ready to take on the test, looking to move to the jump off. And another horse rider combination that you see this rapport where the horse and rider really understand one another and they communicate so well. Lauren feels very confident on this horse and this horse, as we've seen over the years, loves to jump at Spruce Meadows. 1991 model, member of the Sydney Olympic effort for the United States and last year came out of the blocks at Spruce Meadows with two consecutive wins and they've just dealt themselves out of the equation today. That water line you spoke of takes another victim. Right there, she jumped off the triple bar. You could see her pulling her horse, but she was late in that move. And Classico is such a big horse that he got right underneath the vertical and he couldn't help but push the jump out of the way. So they sit on four faults now. Horse is jumping well. Although the drainage system at Spruce Meadows is operated very admirably, you can still hear some of the standing water on course with Classico coming down the final line. Through the triple combination, easy. And to the last jump, no problem. Lauren Huff will be very disappointed in that, though, because jump number 5A caught up with her, and it was a little bit of a riding error. She was too relaxed after the triple bar. Coming into the verticals, she needed to set up Classico earlier before she got to the verticals. Could not get his landing gear up in time, it looks like here. And a great ride to the Canada planks. No problem at those planks. Lauren Huff finishing up with four faults. Just the one rail down at 5A. She departs the stadium and...